Hi everyone. Um, today I would like to show you the uh, the lid cube that I just got. This is a 16 by 16 by 16. The last video um, I have an 8 by 8 by 8. So a total of 512 LED light uh, solder on uh, like a cube. But this one is gonna be uh, 16 by 16 16. So it um, it eight times actually uh, eight times yeah eight times more. So there's uh, the LED it's back it's like a thousand LED in here. So have five five bags so like five thousand. Um, and this is the uh, the main board uh, that came with uh, uh, that. So it 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 have a um, it had a guidance on board directly so you can just follow this and build your uh, uh, layer but uh, this thing is gonna be 16 by 16 so each layer is gonna be 256 so soldering 256 multiplied by 16 so it's gonna be taking a while um, the 8 by 8 by 8 it took me um, probably 8 hours total to solder everything but this one gonna be more so it's gonna be some uh, weekend project gonna take uh, you know a couple months for sure um, so look uh, the boy I hook it in and the light flashing so it looked like working um, and um, you know, I'm gonna start soldering it uh, one by one hopefully I can do one layer uh, a day so it's gonna take me uh, 16 days at least right um, and after that and solder to the board uh, yeah it's gonna be a long project but uh, it's gonna be a fun project um, I really like the LED light that um, at least with the 16 you can see uh, a little bit more higher pixel more detail and uh, that's what I'm uh, looking for so the board already came with uh, all the, the chip uh, solder so it's just a matter for you um, to uh, build the, the LED layers um, and uh, that's pretty much it uh, gonna start soldering it and uh, start a project so I probably need to track how much time I spend on this because last time 8 by 8 by 8 is worth around roughly so, yeah, I think like 8 hours um, and each layer only um, 8 by 8 so 64 right 64 an hour per layer pretty much so. all right let's start oh at the same time um, also bought the um, acrylic case so that you can put inside put the LED board inside uh, it uh, I bought them separately but it came in the same mail so so good so far so here and then um, this guy doesn't come a whole lot it's just the cable and uh, the pin it's the auto pin I have an extra chip right here I don't know what but I don't expect more solder or anything but um, so the uh, pin you go to solder to the board so that you can hook your layer and um, and uh, all of the uh, screw right here um, cable remote control so it came pretty simple um, get LED and the back and, you know all right let's start going now. so um, anode gonna bend straight down and then the cathode gonna be on top of it uh, like a 90 degree angle, but a little bit uh, above it. See, it's a little bit above it, but this is gonna be this way. So we're gonna end up going all the way. Okay. So the shorter one is anno. Make sure we don't forget. And it's small, so not easy to handle. It's like a bigger five millimeter uh, LED. solder one, one two to make sure that we have on the right track here. Um, yeah. 
think about it. Okay. Maybe it's your timing it. Okay. Painting it. Add. Okay. Maybe not 30 seconds, but see how fast it is. Okay, you need 16 of these. Now I'm going to test a little bit. Um, so the anode this way, so tip that, light up, light up. While you prepare, you will notice there are some of them with a break, and then you have to do again. So that adds extra time. So you can see the layer after I put it into the bowl before solder. So right now, all the pin loose. I'm gonna solder all of these things first. I'm put I'm gonna put plug um, in between here for all of them to help with the, the soldering.
Okay, so bit solder halfway so far, and uh, getting this thing into a socket with a pin because you know not all the pin uh, equal length. So end up like you have to guide them with uh, uh, with a tool, and that's why I make it difficult. Um, and on top of that, this thing is uh, long, so they they're not very um, straight. So you have to add a lot of support. For example, uh, see all these things right here? A uh, little bar. Um, that I'm adding here to gain, to make it more rigid. So, um, I haven't done much on the side, but, you know, the side should have something similar. Uh, like a bar right here. Right here too. So far, halfway. I thought this thing was quick, but, you know, adding to this bore is a lot more work. Wow. So, very light and finish. This is the cube 6x16, got a total of 4096 LED. And this is what it looks like. Kind of very density. High density lighting. Um, Let's see my front. Um, got a memory card right here uh, for the animation. density uh, cube this is all the wire in the back um, I cube no case yet I'm going to put a case in and uh, let's see the picture oh. ok so the cube now finished and uh, this is what it looks like pretty cool Okay, so here we are with the side by side comparison. This is the 8 by 8 by 8, um, and this is 16 by 16 by 16 mini. So the mini because the LED only a three uh, millimeter, three uh, millimeter, and what's this? This is a five millimeter. Okay, um, so you can see it's a little bit bigger, actually. Yeah, bigger, but it, it's a lot more LED. This is 512 versus 4096 LEDs and meaning that 8 8 of these equal 1 of these okay you have to solder 8 of these equal 1 of these you guys you know that there's a lot of work there um, so I'm gonna power it on um, the power on this one little picky because there's so many LEDs you have to get the right power supply uh, it has to be 5 volt and um, I think it's gonna be mid more than 6 amp uh, because think about it, it's uh, 20 milliamp per LED and you can multiply and you, you can see that how much. So, and if, if I had a wire too long and uh, it won't power up, it power up but it's it in a very weird state, it doesn't flash at all. So I have to make sure the, the, the power core is really short so it can uh, do enough power so the voltage doesn't drop too much. So I think the resistance in the wire causing uh, this thing doesn't light up correctly. So I'm gonna power it up and uh, we'll see, okay? Okay, so this is by default. Um, this one, it actually take in the memory card as well as the uh, 8x8. And, uh, and by default, it, it's gonna have the flashing, just like that's like a, a swear. And uh, something like chasing around in the metal. Um, 8x8, uh, let me turn it to uh, smoke. See that it's um, flashing right there. Okay? Um, and it's in white. So you can see it's the. So by default, it's gonna be that. And then there's a tech mode. I mean, I'm not sure what tech mode. When you hit it, it display uh, a bunch of Chinese characters. So now, now I'm going to switch back to the tech mode, uh, the effect mode. Oh, 
Nej. Ja. Now I'm going to insert a memory card, that, which is you can download from uh, when you uh, they give you a link uh, like a Google Share Drive, and you can just download uh, that and uh, insert the memory card. Okay. Okay. So now, so now drop the sequence. And you actually can customize the uh, effect as well. They uh, give a uh, software that you can uh, uh, you play your own effect. This way you can have that. And for the And the 16, 6x16 six, six is a lot nicer. You can add no more LED. So I make a uh, wooden box that uh, like a stand so you can put on top. So this is the uh, actual when it's done and the light turn on. I actually uh, use the uh, the PC power supply because it has more power. Um, the regular power supply doesn't have enough uh, power to to power 4096 LEDs. So I'm actually use these uh, the um, PC power supply to power this and since I had a, a PC power supply I decided to make a box a wooden box out of it uh, to put on top uh, right now uh, the box is unpainted but uh, in a later time I'm gonna paint uh, this box and make it a, uh, a, uh, a you know I mean hiding all the uh, power supply so right now it's, uh, it's running and uh, looking pretty good all the white LED and all perfect. And uh, see from top, top down, and then on the side. Uh, I didn't modify the uh, the pattern, so you can see some Chinese uh, letter in here. Uh, but uh, look pretty cool with the box and everything, and it looked pretty complete. 